Wow, wow, wow. What an amazing, entertaining show in Poland that was. I'm one of the youngest junior year of vision commentators. I have been reviewing songs and loving songs for three years now. And I would like to thank all of those kind viewers and subscribers for being with me every single video, every single season. Thank you so much. Great job to all the organizers and all the performers for making the show so interesting to watch. Yerzhen's voice is so, so, so powerful. I mean, this song is so risky and so hard to do. Like, I don't know if anyone I know personally could do that in my life, but he does it so effortlessly. And his voice is so beautiful and powerful. He has such control. Like, whoever taught him that is the best teacher in the world. This is probably the most control of a voice that I've ever seen in my life, in the history of Eurovision. In all my three years, okay, it doesn't sound like much, but you should actually try. It's like 1,000 something days. In all my three years of listening to Junior Eurovision songs, this man, I mean, this boy has the best voice. See, I even called him a man because he's so professional. His voice is amazing. It's like I'm listening to a man. It's kind of like you you have a man and then you kind of shrunk him down because he's just so professional and his style of singing, it's like he just shrunk a man down. Great job, Kazakhstan, and thank you so much for choosing to perform in Junior Eurovision. He is so charismatic and he's so friendly, he's so likable. I mean, he has everything you need in the singer. I think he's going to be one of the top singers in Kazakhstan, if he isn't already. When I listen to the song, I really get a Disney vibe from it. Like, I know that the chances are low, but I really hope that Disney will see this song one day and actually put it in one of their movies. That would be sick. That would be awesome. Kazakhstan are newcomers to Junior Eurovision. But anyways, they are amazing so far. I mean, last year there was Danelia Tuleshova, I think that's her name. And now this year, Yerzhan was amazing. Amazing! Melanie has one of the most beautiful girl voices this year, and Yerzhan has one of the most beautiful male voices this year. So I think that if you mix them two together, it would be an amazing, spectacular, excellent, fantastic, an amazing, award-winning duo. They could actually be like the opening guest performers in the beginning or when they're waiting for the votes to come in. That would actually be really cool. Wait, I might actually email them right now. Wait. Okay, guys, I emailed them. Now let's go back to the video. It's no wonder that the juries love the song so much and that they actually gave him a chance because they're looking at the capabilities of the voice, how much control they have, how powerful the voice is, how much quality the song has, and televoters are just voting from the heart or, their, or for their country's neighbors or for the country sometimes. And yeah, like that's why Kazakhstan got so many points in the jury voting, in my opinion. So I think that this was amazing. Guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. I have spent many, many hours working on Junior Eurovision this season and every season. I'm always super happy when I see a lot of likes or subscribers or a lot of shares. Thank you very much. If you really, really crave Junior Eurovision, well, be sure to check out my Eurovision playlist. And guys, I would really, really, really appreciate it if you would check out my sister's channel, Corina's World. And you will see if we share the same opinion or a completely different opinion. Thank you so much for watching and stay tuned for the next Junior Eurovision video.